Martin. Time to go house shop. I don't know. Mission today, honey. To find this house, okay? Taking a little lunch break, right quick, okay? Okay, okay. Oh, this the squad. So Friday I put out just uh I was in my feelings in the moment. I put that out um with no editing and I want you guys to let me know if you like those type of videos. Um because it definitely helps me um put them up faster, okay? No thought to be had, okay? So, Nisa Squad, welcome back to my channel. I miss y'all immensely. Um, as I told y'all in Friday, um, just a lot going on. Life ain't, you know, unicorns and rainbows and starry fairy tale shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is some real life shit going on. So, I think, I think we found a house. Fingers crossed, okay? Fingers crossed, palms pressed, prayers going up, okay? I think we found a house. Um, step one has already been a thumbs up. Now we're on step two, which is the review. And we'll see how all of that goes. And then... Hopefully, by the end of the week, I will know if this is, like, something that's about to be mm, in stone. You know it ain't in stone until you sign the dotted line and you do your closing, okay? But, however, I just need to know that we is moving in that direction. So, when they say, God may not come when you want to, he come when he wants to, on his time. And everything go well. I'm going to start a series on us moving to our forever home. Um, not going to show y'all it or anything. I'm not going to jinx it. None of that shit. Okay. So the little bit I told y'all I shouldn't. Have. However, I just told y'all so y'all can not be worrying about your girl. However, I will start a series on that because forever home, new things, new prospects, um, new furniture, uh, new style, new swag. My beauty room pretty much gonna stay the same. However, like, my public living spaces and all that shit. Everything's gonna change, you know? Everything. Um, I told y'all last week about that. Um, so, that's a plus in the right direction. Um, what else, what else? What else? I thought I had some more good news to share with y'all. Um, Women Who Wine with Men was a success Saturday. If you have not watched that episode of Women Who Wine, it's three hours long, but it's worth every damn minute to watch, okay? Because this is a male versus a female perspective you know how we think and our thought processes um y'all was tan shorty up in the comments honey tan him up so that was a huge success and like i said i have so much stuff like in my head i have been getting it out of my head by writing it down implementing getting some shit done i'm gonna tell y'all what i wish i had in my life right now i wish i had a creative director someone who could direct me um however my my number one thing is you gotta let stuff be be stuff okay i ain't trying to be uh nobody else but me okay i like me i'm no i love me okay so when i say creative director just you know i want to do a new intro um like to see somebody from the outside looking in like what do they think like my intro should be about um or how it should be set up and stuff like that i want to actually do an intro for women who wine with all of us together my mom my sisters to make uh, my daughters all of us i i just I, I see that too um i'm just i'm just 2020 was rough 
yet 2020 really made you realize like <laughs> chick you need to get your shit together okay um give us time to think process um purge detox the whole shebang okay so i am embracing this new year as <sighs> first well second year of a new decade yeah second of a new decade a lot of shit going on got inauguration tomorrow i pray everything is safe for president biden and vice president madam harris okay i think she's gonna look good for us black women honey okay she's gonna she's a good good look michelle obama was a great look fantastic look Kamala gonna do as well too. Okay, she is. Um, I did have some sad news to tell y'all though. Um, last vlog I posted, um, I told y'all that my grandmother was ill and they didn't think she had long. Well, Saturday morning, while I was out house hunting, um, I got notice that um, she went on to glory. Um, I have cried, um, I have been really sad, yet this is what I'm going to tell y'all about my grandmother. Y'all have seen her before in my vlogs, um, my grandma Minnie, and she, she just was, she was all that, okay? Um, I was close to her, more close to her than I am my own father. Um, every time I would go to Florida, I made sure I visited. Um, y'all have seen, um, just her spirit. She had a good, good spirit. And I just feel like that was my last living biological grandparent that has now gone on to glory. She was 86 years old. Um, she lived a very full, exciting life. She had... Ooh, when I said she had a lot of churn, she had a lot of churn, honey. It just running our family to have a lot of kids. You feel me? Um, yet, you, we just, I guess we all knew this was going to eventually come. Um, because she just has been deteriorating over the years. Yet, I was just so happy to see she went on her own terms, you know. Um, it wasn't nothing about, you know, she was on life support or anything like that. She just, she slept and went on to greet her father in heaven. Yet, she, she, she could barely see. Um, she couldn't talk anymore. Um, she had had a stroke and they said one of the things it can go either way you know she can people who have had strokes can either when they can't speak and stuff again they can either cry all the time or they can laugh all the time she laughed all the time um to not be able and i was telling my husband this to not be able to see and being that i am someone who is very very visual and being able not to talk that is something y'all know your girl got credentials, okay? Not being able to talk. And then one of the most things, one of the things I love to do and don't even realize I love to do is laugh. I have been told my laugh is contagious in the old shebang. And to not be able to see, talk, or laugh, what kind of life is that? So... I'm sad that she's gone. However, I'm not selfish. She lives a long life. Um, she's a beautiful woman. And she will forever be a part of me. Um, her and my grandma, let's see. Like, they were great grandmothers. And I do have a, um extended grandmother through my sister Tiff. I love her grandmother too to death. Um, and thankfully she's still with us um so i feel like i got one more that's from my extended family yeah my biological she was the last um i know she in a better place 
I do believe, y'all, when we go on to glory, I do believe that when God lets us in the gates of heaven, that we are reborn again and we are brought back to our best self on earth, okay? Our best self. So, that means if your best, you was fly and you was child, you know, they got, they got it going on up in heaven, honey. You was reborn. You was anew. Okay? Okay. So, I wanted to just catch y'all up on that real quick. I'm about to um, run to the grocery store. I need to run to the beauty supply store. Um, it's Taco Tuesdays at our house tonight. So, I'm cooking dinner. Jazz did it last Tuesday. And I just need to go pick up a couple things because Thursday, me and Mr. Long are going to Florida. And we are going to go celebrate Ashley's grand opening of her new facility. And I'm so, so, so proud of my sister. So I want to make sure I have all my shit together. I need to come home back and tidy up my uh, fashion den. Okay? I wouldn't be a true diva child if you didn't see some type of chaos, okay? Anywho, and then I want to start packing tonight. I'm somebody who likes to pack the day before, so as time goes on, I can keep adding shit to the, the suitcase. So, I'm about to go. That's my bag. Y'all have not officially. Oh yes, I did. Y'all met her. Y'all met um, bum, bummy on Christmas Day because I was walking around with it. So I have on a Black Lives Matter t-shirt dress. I have on some some kicks. <laughs> I have on a long cardigan, and I'm about to step out about maybe about two hours at the most but do what I gotta do and then come back get dinner started and then start picking out what I'm gonna wear while in Florida so I can pack light so that's so cute no, he cracked, he cracked his phone today. Like, really, 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 really. I'm talking to my mom real quick. He cracked his phone really, really bad. Because it fell in his pocket. So he can't use the screen at all. So he memorized my number to call me. Yeah, cute stuff, right? That's cute. You know daddy done by heart? Yes. What is it? I'm not saying it. I'm on camera. Oh. <laughs> but I know. Okay. Um, okay, you can go ahead, Shane. Go ahead. So Jada's with me for the run. Um, I'm gonna tell you, when you be in the house for so many days, why do you? Um, why do you? You really don't be knowing like what the temperature you tell is outside. Number, like, so my real. contact name. So I need to go to the beauty supply store first. Chili. Sure. And then Jada and I are going to the grocery store. No, we are going to the market. What did your dad say about it? I heard somebody said it. What did your dad say about it? Better way to call it the market. So, we'll holla when we get in the market. Jada and I are at the market. It's not me. I looking like a bum. No, you got your own damn <laughs> stuff out here looking like a bum. Mama don't do them things, honey. The top of my hair is not Did I ask her? I changed it. We need a buggy. Then get a buggy. Girl, go get us a car. Don't play. I, I gotta get the car. Cause you the child. Anywho, y'all. Oh my lady. Oh. It's Taco Tuesdays at the Longs. Taco Tuesdays. And we're gonna have a different type of taco tonight. Yes, I hope y'all can hear me. If not, sorry. So Jada is unpacking the the cart. That is her responsibility, huh, Jess? 
and I just stand over here and be cute. <laughs> and that's my cute um, cashier. <sighs> that's the least they could do. So we having veggie, veggie, lettuce wrap tacos. Tomorrow I'm making some smoked turkey neck bones, some black eyed peas, and some rice. Is, how many in there? I think it was two cases for nine dollars. Yeah. Okay. Ain't nobody paying twenty three eighty eight for some bougie ass of water. Okay. So just send Jada ass back there. But the cashier says bothering her because what I said it was supposed to be. That's what it's supposed to be. <laughs> I said it's some bougie water. I know. It just was more out. Jada is pushing a cart. We saw the mystery of the water. It's by three cases of Poland Springs water, and you get two free 30.4 ounce water bottles. We solved it. Oh, child, it is ready for Valentine's Day, okay? All right, so. I see little Jada. It's Jada. She had just like a hairstylist. Literally, changes they hair every three weeks. Every two, shoot, no, this two, two weeks is good for her. She mad because she pushing that car. She be all right. They gonna eat though, right? Facts. <sighs> That I woke up feeling this way. I can't help but sound. Hold up, let me get the key. And I don't need nobody else. Go ahead, Carl. Who did what? What she, anywho, a girl, what she did? Walk by you? She stopped by me. <sighs> and you wanna know where your mama from? She stopped by me on purpose and I know she knows it's me. I don't look that different than I don't put a mask on my face. I really don't. <laughs> Excuse me. Cause you ain't gonna say God bless you mommy. God bless you. Oh. I know how she works. She wanted me to say something. Jada, that little girl or that little woman, how's she gonna fight somebody? She's so little. Oh, she's very fragile. I she, see that. She runs out of breath when she walks up the stairs. I could have blew on her and she would have fell out. Yeah, that's what I, I just noticed. But I know you know you. I was like, Jada, don't want to go get that water because are you scared? No, I just know I don't like being in drama. Like, you know that by now. If I would have gone to a fight back there, girl, you would have not known. Listen, I am from a, a town called I wish a bitch would, okay? You hear me? Okay. You gonna put them in the. It's not about scary, it's the fact that I don't fight. I'm touched. Well, you ain't never gotta worry about fighting unless somebody touch you, child. You ain't never gotta worry about fighting. As long as nobody put their hands on you. But that shit wasn't gonna go down. And all that shit she be talking that you said, and then I saw her and I was like, this is my whole take on. Don't ever, ever. Woo -woo -woo. Don't, don't ever judge somebody by their size. Never do that. Well, Shaheen says she's never gotten into a fight. She's just But a she be, <sighs> see, I, I'm not, I'm not, I am not one of them, okay? The most person she got into a fight with is her boyfriend. What's What you mean she got in a fight with her boyfriend? A physical fight? No, a play play fight. Oh. I 
I saw her when she, she did by. that on purpose. She you so I know you seen her. She stopped. It's okay. And I saw her at my peripheral vision, like. That's why when she be arguing with me saying she gonna swap me, I just, I just laugh at it. If you can't slap me when I'm with my mama, you're not bold enough to be saying you're gonna slap somebody. You don't need to be saying it at all. No. Cause Cause I, I, like I, I said, no, I nobody would ever try that shit. If I was with grandma, tell the bitch talk about she gonna slap me. Mama gonna slap the bitch before she can even get on and slap the bitch out her mouth, okay? You don't fight, but this is the thing. You don't I fight. I don't fight unless I really, really, really have to. <sighs> That's the only... Th I've only been in one fight my whole and if you, life. You've always said, don't put your hands on people unless they put their hands on you first. And that's, that's true. That's the only way I ever fight. So y'all, that didn't happen. Didn't go down. Wasn't gonna go down. Mm -hmm. Little girl. So we are back home cooking tacos. I'm grounding, I mean browning my ground turkey. I'm getting ready to season it up. I don't measure, so y'all should already know that about your girl. I don't measure nothing. I just leave in coating the top twice or two days. You can smell your food. Like, smell it, smell it. Yeah, now. Okay? That was taco seasoning, just saw me use. Now I'm doing some garlic powder, just a little bit, a little garlic salt. Just a little, some lemon pepper. This is all up. My favorite pan to use are cast iron i love it particularly when you like browning any type of meat nice good coloring and i've had to teach these girls how to clean the damn pot because you don't put this in no dishwasher you feel me so my wok does not have a lid that is the size of this and this wok is by Cuisine Art, okay? And so I just use the biggest lid that I have for my biggest skillet. This is the top to my chicken fryer to, you know, submerge that. So these oh. are all the ingredients I have. I've already chopped up the purple onions, tomatoes. I'm about to wash and clean. The lettuce because that's gonna serve as the taco shell tonight. I have Shop Rights Taco Blend Natural Cheese. I have Chi Cheese Medium Thick and Chunky Salsa. I also have some sour cream for those who like them. And because I still want a slight crunch, I will take some of the chips and crunch them up in a Ziploc bag. And crunch them inside the taco so I can still have a crunch okay crunching is important so so I'm the type of chick I like to put my salsa also in the meat mixture give it some more flavor right here is the bomb it's called total seasoning it has a little bit of some of everything in it these leaves and get ready to wash and yeah time to wash it's holding it together so I'm getting ready to make the first one okay so I've got my bowl okay 
Okay, got the meat. Try to keep it in the center. Okay. Cheese. He had regular Vito's. Huh? Nice spicy. Let me try. I'll be the first one to try. Um, yeah, this is a little... Maybe I'll put too much meat. That's what I think it is. I'll put too much meat. So, let's see. Um, Not gonna work. Mm -mm. I try. I think I need some um, some lettuce that's a little bit more coarse the texture. They banging, but y'all. Mm -mm. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make this a regular nacho bowl. Cause this thing gonna work. Maybe I need two pieces of lettuce. Mm. It's banging now. This ain't working. You're putting too much, that's why. This is not a real taco, mommy. This is a piece of lettuce. <laughs> and you acting like it's a whole taco. <laughs> this you ain't. You have to make like four of them. Four is two. I'm gonna try one more time before I give up. She got all that stuff on, like that's all whole that on. It, it's good too though. You still have soft tacos in the pantry. Also. The whole point of taco too is try different. Okay, but if she can't try soft tacos, she can get it. She, that's way too much. Well, get your ass down here and make your own. Okay. Tell me, so I made like a real taco. I'm going to eat Mmm. It's a miracle. We used to everything go big. Maybe I should. And I'm messing up the membrane. Mm. Y'all are making me want to dance. Mm. You already did that. Huh? Oh! Oh, I got issues! 
shoes. You thought you could put up. Oh, that's still too much. That's still too much. You gotta do it, mommy, like, like P.F. Chains. It's not that much you're putting on the piece of lettuce. Well, P.F. Chains don't even make it where when you come, when it comes to the table, it don't even be done. Like, you have to do it yourself. Well, your daddy gonna eat that, just like that. Did you just take my other two pieces of lettuce? I don't know, I just picked lettuce up. You picked it up from my hair? No, I picked it up from the bin. That had dried my lettuce. It does. It was delicious and a very healthy cooking. Why'd you hang up? Y'all, this is my, my oh. wannabe son-in-law. Oh, she's recording you also, so wave. Say hey. <laughs> I'm blessed and highly favored. A, a nice, healthy way, right? It was on point. What? Him? It was, and I even want some more. Jeez, Jazz, Jazz, go make another mistake. No, I was gonna say you got it by mistake, Bond. So Jazz got us a beverage, mango, and absolute grapefruit. I tell you, you gonna be lit. This is the concoction. Room? I'm gonna share it with my baby deity. The, oh yeah. Oh no, he had three. So this is this was the secret. You wanna know what I had to do? Two. You have to use, use two. two pieces of lettuce. So next time I will buy two bundle, huh? Two bundles of um. Lettuce. Lettuce. What is it? Jada, what you gonna make next Tuesday? It'll be the day after my birthday. I don't know. I ain't got that far yet. I still won't basic. Wait, I'm though. still on this Tuesday. Okay. Nope. I, just, I ain't got no money, so you might get basic. Nope. Mommy gonna hook you up. Like, what for? She ain't gonna be here. She knows your bank information. Did y'all hear that? Mm -hmm. She said, Mommy gonna hook you up. You know? For my birthday? You won't even be here. Oh, it's kind of tucking you downstairs too. You sure it ain't uh, expired no. like the one in the freezer? No, that's your fault. So what am I? No, putting? mommy, it looked like that Excuse before. Me. So it, what am I? it said November. So how's that? Excuse not me. Once you freeze something, it's good. What? What am I putting on these? Like what you put on it? Oh, okay. So, on you, so give me out that camera. I eat this because I want to eat sloppy. And I don't know. You want to just eat it all I'm up? I'm eating my piece. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> what he said? Yes, he said I yelled. He said my mother would have cut me. Child, she is about to get cut. You see, you, you see that knife? Right. See that knife? What am I putting on this? What am I putting on this? Let me get Yeah, go ahead. What? Oh, you want to see me cut her? No, mommy. <laughs> <laughs> he want to oh see me cut her. So you put you some cheese, some tomatoes. What These are the hot Doritos. Tell him Jada done got him the. Trust me, she know how he far to take you. me. You're very close he to know my how AirPod. far to take. Why are you growling, girl? Why that little girl was at the grocery store wanting to beat her up? I told her. She said she didn't. So I'm confused. No, 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 no. no, no. She, she said the little she, girl she wanted to beat her up. But she did. She just big. I know that is literally. No, no, no. Jay got more weight on her than that little girl. But y'all both are little people. Just how you said Carson is skinny. She's skinny. You never seen Carson on top. Only I can say that. No, look. I I could have did this. And she would have been. She would have fell out. You can keep your breath over there. Don't do my mother. Mommy, come on now. You're doing that to Shaheen. <laughs> Shaheen, but might want to get used to this. This is how we do over here. He can do it if he did it right back. <laughs> did? Yeah. Let me see it. You can't see it. Let me see it. <laughs> what the hell have you done? I don't know. He was, he was giving me a pound. Mom, come on, nine food. You said that's the story. Okay. Chips, your salsa, and then roll it up. No sour cream. I didn't have sour cream. We was one hundred. I just seen Jazz had sour cream on her. I she just did. did that. Like I, but it, you don't need it because it's banging I like, like that. Okay. All so right. You have lettuce. Oh. <laughs> 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 Jasmine said, "She." You said it like 
like James Long. Oh, Dave. Shh. Why is y'all bothering? Oh, look, Jada. What's up? That was bothering. What's up? Did you really have your fist up at this camera? Yeah. You can tell the truth. Yeah. Why he look like he froze now? The camera is at. You had your fist up at this camera. Mommy, obviously you can't hear him. Tell, tell him what I said. said. Did you have your fist up at the camera? He said yeah. Uh, that was a pound, right? He said, she said was that a pound. Okay, that was a pound. Okay, I'm going to accept that. Yeah. It's on the charger. My charger. <sighs> oh, the lettuce. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm coming on here because I need some help. Whoever live in South Florida, all the way down, dirty, dirty south, I need y'all to tell me what the weather is like. Because you guys are getting ready to pack to come to Florida. And I need to know how to pack. I done looked at the weather report, but what's cold to my mama and my sister ain't cold to me. You feel me? Let me know, please. I hope you guys enjoyed yesterday's vlog. Because I'm about to start a new one. Okay. So I will see y'all. <laughs> Next time y'all see me. I'm going to be cleaning the house. <laughs> Real talk.